Hello, thank you for having me very much. Um, thank you. This is like a real life mukbang, watching you all eat. Uh, I've got the order performers and I'm at the speaker. Um, uh, thank you very much, BC, for all your work. Thank you for this night. Happy EC Heritage Month, everyone! <laughs> So this is a piece I wrote, it's about uh, plants, plant biology, and my life. So, super price of one. Propagation is when you take a cutting from the mother plant to make a new plant. You cut a piece off, place it directly into soil, or compost, or into water, and you wait for the roots to grow out. When you propagate a cutting into water, it takes a few weeks for the roots to emerge. The delicate, thin, spindly, white trails slowly falling into water like the streaks left behind by airplanes. I'm about one years old. No one's ever been able to confirm if I spent my first birthday or not in Hong Kong. We've landed in Southampton, a city selected by my father because he recognised it as a city where the Titanic sailed from. <laughs> we spend the next 18-ish years growing up in the suburbs of a large-ish town. After the cutting has grown enough roots, you can transfer it into soil. You can bury the roots into a small plant pot packed with soil, hope it will survive the transition. Keep the plant pot indoors. Don't give it too much water, but water it enough. Give it sun, but not too much. A little fertilizer now and then, but don't overdo it. Avoid grass, insects, mold, animals, fire, dropping it from high places. Children haven't learned how cruel their hands are. Did you know there were so many dangers? The neighbourhood gets progressively worse. It is almost impossible to leave the house without receiving racism, and sometimes it comes knocking on our door. It comes from fellow school students like it's a reflex for them, from the jowls of white men, their bellies full of cheap beer and news propaganda, hate, but mostly from young boys in between petty crime. The ones who will progress from ASBOs to young offender institutions and then in and out of prison. But for now, they practice on people like me and we are the only people like me here. I do not go outside except to go to school. I stay inside for years. If your newly rooted plant is not doing well, you can take another cutting and try to propagate it again. Avoid ripping off the cutting. The less traumatized it is, the better it will grow. My dad has always been angry and I am tired of always being scared. So I moved to London after years of studying and burnout and go straight into a cycle of toxic startups. I move houses and jobs again and again and then again, uprooting, tearing myself out the ground. I take my books with me from home to home, hold on to them for its proximity to trees, to its roots. I'm asking, I have survived everything. I have made it outside for what? For this? Scientists call the fungal network the wood wide web. It's an underground network of everything from pathogens to plant roots and fungi. And it's what plants use to communicate with each other. They can support each other, help distribute nutrients more evenly and ensures their survival. This suggests that it's symbiosis neutral help and not competition that leaves evolution. I am performing poetry that I wrote in basement bars on the ground, in pubs, spare rooms, in venues squeezed into high streets. I am learning to not be scared all the time. And people listen. They really listen and we talk and we laugh and we write together, we clap and we cheer and we are filled with joy when we see each other. We share stories. We share our lives, our hopes, ourselves. We are writing our way up and out into the air, writing our way to each other, reaching out. We hold each other when one of us is lost, like there is too much space left behind in our absence. Like that space has been filled with grief and we are trying to close it out. Fungal networks are ancient and have existed as long as plant life has existed on this planet. Mark Tersick former CEO of the Nature Conservancy said, if trees are the lungs of the planet, fungal networks on circulatory systems. Community is marginal mornings, and laughing on the streetlights when everything is closed. It's friends of friends, it's DMs and emails, it's whisper networks protect each other, it's putting each other up and keeping the ladder down. 
We are reaching up to breathe and rooting down to live. We have always needed each other. We will always need each other. Thank you.